Well, well, well. Looky, looky, looky. The old panner's doing something other than panning and playing games today. All right, folks, welcome everybody. This is the living room panner, and I'm in the uh, the house of custom mobiles. All right, folks, YouTube is in no way affiliated sponsoring or endorsing, so let's get on with it. This is just a little update on our work in progress. Uh, a friend of mine that lets us work up here and help him out as he customizes these vehicles. Uh, we've been up here the last couple of days helping him out and the shop is definitely growing. Since the last time I made a video in here, there's been several changes. So uh, those of y'all that saw the previous video may recognize the changes and some of y'all, this may be your first time, so you may not. But uh, this is the latest acquirement right here, my friends. And this is a 49 Cadillac. And man, this is his uh, favorite vehicle. Uh, the fella's name is Mike, and he loves caddies. And man, this thing is just pristine. We had it up this morning and looked under it. Interior, this thing is awesome. Not much rust. Rust isn't an issue. We always cut it out and replace it. But the patina on the body, is what he's all about now I don't get that personally but it, this this body will stay the same as it looks right now and everything under it and inside of it's gonna be brand new with a huge engine in it so let's walk this way look at some other stuff the boys are outside blasting the Impala I think that's that 69 Impala we started tearing down a couple of weeks ago this is our parts room. A lot of work in progress in here. Coming right along. And as we work our way down, got that big 250 right there. And folks, we're gonna do something crazy with that thing. We're gonna cut the skin off of the cab and that extended cab over in the corner is gonna go on it. All the guts and everything stay with it. So it's gonna be a an old body with a new truck under it. Here's old junkyard truck, but it's not a junkyard underneath. Everything under this thing's brand new. It's that patina that makes it so special to him. I don't even know what year this thing is. It's just old. Got lifts in it and stuff. There's the bed. Here's that big C110 or C30, something like that, of old dually. Yeah, it's fixing to go out of here. And this is one he finished. Beautiful little dually. Look at the monster motor in this thing. When this thing fires up, boy, it makes some noise, let me tell you. So he's fixing to send this off to get some, uh, the AC, I think, done on it. You got 18-wheeler wheels on that sucker, man. You ever seen anything like that? Look at that. Pretty interesting. And here's the wagon we've been working on. We've been working on this probably about three months. And he's already got the inside four panels cut out. But because he's got this huge transmission and engine, got to rework our bottom down there so now it's going to be like a uh, it's going to have like a bucket seats in it instead of bench seats to allow for that big drive shaft going through it got a little old baby motor on it another chassis ready for going the other trucks there's that Lightning, that Ford Lightning Limited Edition. The Blazer, GMC. There's the Blazer. They can be building that up. Oh, there's a unique vehicle. Forklift right there. Work van. There's a Dually right there, getting rebuilt. Just a lot of work in progress up here. This fella keeps us busy. Plus, we did all the sign work around here and 
he buys these antique signs and they're costly but they're unique as well every one of them so it's fun working up here it's in the air condition and anytime i don't have any side work going on this is where we come so just a little old quick update i think i have uh perry at nickel and dimes on the list for the car draws and uh mo noop's got three coming so y'all stay tuned that'll be coming up here in the near future so appreciate y'all's time hope y'all enjoyed this video if you did hit the like button if you didn't tell me why maybe i'll fix it all right folks well you know what the old panner says later taters